Hi everyone, I'm Elena and welcome to Makeup Fabulousness. Today I'm going to be featuring two of the shades from Kylie Cosmetics, Kristen and Malibu. Um, and pretty much I was very impressed with how they delivered things. Um, I like the personal touches that Kylie Jenner puts in these and even though I'm not the biggest Kardashian fan, I've heard a lot about the lipstick so I wanted to try it for myself. So, I'm just going to go ahead and dive right in and show you what Kristen is like. Um, first, you get, as you know, the lip pencil and the lip, uh, lip, uh, liquid lipstick. <laughs> and I'm just going to swatch each for you really quickly. I like the pencil a lot from when I've tried it. It's really, really soft, like as soft as Urban Decay products, but it's very, very smooth at the same time. And then here is the lipstick. So as you can see, it's a beautiful soft red. Um, this is something you can wear day to night, and I really like this. Um, I think Kylie's middle name is Kristen. Oops. <laughs> and um, not that that has anything to do with it, but I think that's how she came up with the middle name, either that or she named it after her mom, or maybe she did both. And then the second one is Malibu. And same box. She has the cute little heart thing. I like that. It says a lot about her personality. Um, here's the lipstick and the lip liner. And let me swatch it really quick for you. So, yeah, this you can see this. There you go. So that's the um, lipstick. And or sorry, lip liner. <laughs> I keep getting these two mixed up. It's a Friday, guys. Cut me some slack. And then there is the um, lipstick. So um, I'm going to go from light to dark, actually. So let me go ahead and do a quick lip swatch of Malibu. So I'm going to bring this in closer and start swatching. Or just give you a live swatch. So she likes to line her whole lips, so I'm going to do that. Now I found these a little bit drying, but I think really the lip liner helps. Because then when the formula dries down, it dries onto the lip liner and not your lips. So I'm pretty much I'm going to just use the lip liner. This seems like it's a really great nude. And no, you can't wear enough nudes. <laughs> Nor reds, because why? They go with everything. It warms you up so that you don't look dead. <laughs> and um, it's light enough where it flatters the skin tones and I don't know about you know if you're a little bit darker how this would work you know you really have to just see what know what works for you this is very liquidy when I put it on But it's light, and that's what I like about it. So this is the lipstick and lip liner. It looks like it has a little bit of that 90s look, but it's not. It reminds me of a little bit lighter version of Honeymoon from NYX. Um, it's maybe a cross between Honeymoon and Corset. But this is a great way if you want to embrace the uh, brown trends of the 90s. So I'm going to go ahead and take this off and I will be back with Kristen. Okay, here's Kristen. So let's start with the lip liner and I think of the two, this one is my favorite. So much, just such a pretty color and I think it's more universally flattering to everybody.
I want the tricky thing with red is that you want to get the lip liner so it gets every little last bit because it makes it a lot easier for you to do the lipstick lipstick application. And this is the lipstick. Um, you guys all know the doe foot, and I got to show you twice. And it applies evenly. It has a very nice liquidy consistency. Um, NYX lip lingerie is more moussey. And the lip liner really makes all the difference. I don't think I'd wear these without. So, this is Kristen. Such a beautiful soft red so and once the lipstick dries it pretty much will have a little wear um but it's not super long wearing my final verdict um these are a great buy however i wouldn't buy them just to buy them i buy them if you find that you really see a color in there that you don't have or it it's just if you're a huge kylie fan um what makes these rise above other lipsticks is that she sells it together in a lip kit. Um, the lip liner is very, very good. Uh, but if you just want the lipstick, guys, there's so many out there. And there's so many dupes for this stuff already. So, you know, with me, if I were to buy more, I would pick and choose. I wouldn't drop everything and just get the newest color. She has come up, out with some incredible colors. Um, so I may pick up a few more. But those are my honest thoughts. Um, what's nice is that the lipstick can be worn by almost anyone. You don't have to be young to wear it. <laughs> um, some of the colors I won't even go near with a 10 foot pole, but not my taste. It's not because there's anything wrong with them. But um, as you can see, these give you, me a nice smooth consistency. I'm gonna kiss my hand. Nothing came off. So um, I recommend these. <laughs> that would be my best advice. But they are a good product, and um, if you just really love the formula, then go for it. So, all right, thank you so much for tuning in, and um, I thank you all for supporting me. It really does mean a lot, and hopefully we'll see you soon. Okay, and remember, one more thing before I go. <laughs> um, don't let anybody diminish your fabulousness. All right, we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.